found a guitar when I was eight in my parents' basement. And, uh, you know, my, my cousin owned a record store. I was just kind of always into music. So by the time I was 13, I was teaching lessons at the store and I was playing in a studio. I was a session guitarist uh, for like country albums and things. Yeah. So all of a sudden my band broke up and the studio burnt down and CBS took its subsidy out of West Virginia. And I was like, I'm from this little town where there's, there was nothing else really to do there. So the, they, they had asked me to audition for the musical in high school. It was West Side Story. And uh, I said, well, okay. So my mother says, you know, this guy just moved back into town who was this opera singer, so why don't you go take a voice lesson with him? He's given voice lessons, and if you're gonna be in a musical, don't embarrass yourself, right? Because I only sung Journey songs with the band, right? <laughs> yeah. So I went into the lesson, and he was like, have you ever thought about, like, singing? Well, I'm here. <laughs> no, I mean, like, singing. Like, like opera. It's like, no, I've never thought about singing opera. It's like, people still do operas? Uh, and he became, he was the best man at my wedding. And uh, I, I basically went to his house every day for three, four hours, and we would watch DVDs of uh, The Ring Cycle and Parsifal and uh, Faust. And I, it was kind of like, for me, it was sort of like being an apprentice. Like I was going to be a cobbler or a blacksmith. You know, and uh, it was over from that point on. I, I also have quit many times. Every time I think I'm out. <laughs> they pull you back. Yeah. <laughs>